today I got my Palladium package in. I just doxed myself to members. So at the top, we have some propaganda. <laughs> we have some Kevin and Sean propaganda. Why do they keep killing trees? They have a website. They don't need to do this anymore. <laughs> All right, let's make sure they didn't sign any of this stuff. I've actually had a couple times where they put sticky notes on there to send me a message. So, okay, not in this one. All right, so. There's the propaganda. And then I have a spacer. And first things first, some of you are gonna love this, some of you are gonna hate this. First edition Palladium Fantasy. Everybody talks, and by everybody I mean some people, talk about how much this is better than second edition. I've literally never played or been part of first edition. Even when we played in the 90s, it was second edition. So this will be my first look ever at Palladium Fantasy first edition. Oh, I got to read this. <laughs> Just so you know, and, and I never, ever, ever asked for anything special from Kevin and Sean. Matter of fact, it looks like I didn't get a t-shirt this time and I asked for one. Damn it. Uh, but <laughs> but you know, I never asked for anything special from Kevin or Sean. There you go. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> and you know what? You can pause it if you want to read it. To the Legion of Myth, John and Brett, for providing legions of role players a place to discuss and shape role-playing. Game on, always, Kevin Sambita 2024. That's right. And honestly, the reason why I look at that is I can go, oh, he said something to us. Dude, that's because of you guys. Apparently a bunch of you guys, and I appreciate this, say thank you to Kevin and Sean uh, that you're recollecting your your uh, you know riffs that you got rid of 30 years ago because of our videos and so forth. Dude, that's freaking awesome. That's awesome. No, that that's this is about you guys. That's, this is why he put that in this book. It wasn't because of me and Brett. It was because of you guys. Book number two. He convinced me. So first of all, I like monster manuals. It's my favorite part of any role-playing game. So hey, Crafty. Uh, so yes, I put the creature feature in there. Uh, now why? Because he convinced me to get it on last Friday's stream. And if you missed last Friday's stream where he talked about uh, running a Halloween one-shot, well, guess what? You're in luck because you're not going to have to wait a month for it. Those videos go live tomorrow. Two of them go live tomorrow. Two of them go live on Sunday. So all four videos, instead of waiting a month, boom go live tomorrow. The reason I like the autographed books and I don't expect anything for me, I just like the autographed ones because it reminds me of how much Palladium appreciate the fans. So, uh, and sure, not every interaction you have with people is perfect, so I, so I get that. But anyway, so there's Creature Feature. Well, if you get Creature Feature, what else do you have to get? Box Nightmares. This is funny. This is funny coming from Kevin. He writes in here, think inside the box. The person who's always thinking outside the box. <laughs> So that's cool. Um, so there we go. Got uh, box nightmares. And I wanted this again because it had some creatures in here. And also, I'm not I'm not good at horror. I'm good at visceral. I'm I can do Ravenloft, but again, I make my Ravenloft visceral, right? So uh, I want to have more exposure to some horror without uh, running Call of Cthulhu. So near and underground. Mutant Underground, Mutant Recovery Teams, Background Campaign, Two Dozen Superhumans, Mutant Characters, Genetic Mishap. Oh, that's kind of cool. Hey, that, that's worth it right there. Genetic Mishap, Power, and Trait Tables. I like that. Oh, Mutant Animals with Super... Okay, so that's actually why I got it. There's the Mutant Animals with Super Abilities. Look at this. What this crazy, man? These Christmas packages. Uh, Rifts, Minnesota. I mean, Canada. People were saying, you guys were saying that there were a lot of good survival rules in here for the cold and whatnot, so uh, I wanted to check those out. Okay, I did order this for Rise of Magic, for Chaos Earth. I kind of stayed away from the Chaos Earth stuff, but uh, uh, I, this one, again, I, I'm trying to pick up on the Magic and the psychic uh, books for riffs again, so I can use them in uh, in other in other venues. Uh, like I said, for I'm saying uh, a lot today. That's weird. So I can use them in other venues, like after the bomb. And also, I kind of want to see the background of how magic came to be, because I have the original, and I almost feel like this is a waste of money. But I've been told that there's some a couple things in here that make it worth getting, so I did. Also, I don't want to ruin my original anymore. And for those who don't know the original, 
this one. I love this cover, man. Uh oh, and I think that is it. Wait, what's this? Oh, that's just the bottom of the box. And cool. So there you go. There was my Christmas surprise package. No t-shirt. I'll write to my congressman about that one. Oh, wow. That's, yeah, I just saw a new one popped up uh, uh, today. Like a new Glitter Boys episode popped up today. So hopefully you guys go watch that after you're done. I'm promoting them so much. They should, they should give me some money.